I'm just gonna be real. I have been, I really have been extremely overwhelmed. Extremely stressed out. I didn't think that gaining a pound would do this to me. It's only a pound, but it did. It's put me in a position that I don't like. It's put me in a in a in a mind space that just it isn't productive for me. It really isn't. So I have been working on coping skills. I have been doing a lot of journaling. I have been, you know, just trying to work on anything that I can to make myself feel feel okay in the place that I'm at right now. But it's not working. Nothing is working. I just feel I just feel like I'm slowly suffocating. And it's not fun. It's not something that I want to do. And it's not something that I wish on anyone. So today, I'm going to do my best. David's in the garage. He's doing some workouts right now. And, and I was going to try to put some makeup on and try to feel okay. Even though the truth is I don't feel like doing anything. All I want to do is just Go back to bed. If you have days like this, please know you're not alone. Please know you're not alone. It's a really hard struggle to deal with. But I'm happy to try to do it with you. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We are going to surprise him by putting some makeup on. I'm hoping that by putting makeup on, it'll control the tears because you don't want to cry <laughs> mascara down your face and have it everywhere. And it's just, it's it's always been something that I've tried to do when I just, couldn't control my emotions but let's see how it works out let's see how it works out <sighs> so when I was a teenager I figured out that when I was having uncontrollable emotions that would cause me just to cry for what felt like no reason Putting makeup on, especially a lot of mascara and colorful eyeshadow, would really help me to be able to control the tears a lot better than had I done nothing. Now, it didn't stop it, but it did give me an edge over doing nothing. And it really just one day became my go-to. I didn't even realize that it was something that that was helping until I got to the point that it became my my really the biggest tool that I had in my toolbox for combating these uncontrollable just crying outbursts I really hated to explain why my colorful eyeshadow was dripping down my face or why I looked like a raccoon because my mascara went running down my face or why my foundation and my blush was streaky so it helped me in a way that was just sort of vain but for some reason the therapy of being creative by putting on all these different colors just worked so why not let's see how this works out so so far so good it's i mean mostly you can tell I still cried a little, but not that bad. So, I guess it's working. 